So when we're trying to like create recipes, we're not always creating them for us. But you really want other people to cook it. You really want other people to cook it and successfully. Between me and Rebecca, we're constantly trying to make sure the journey is as clean and as clear as possible. Some books we write and it's just like get on with business and this is what you're doing, it's more of a manual. This one's going to be full of emotion. Some bay leaves, a couple of sausages torn up, roughly 80 grams of veg each, a squash, onions and celery. I think we, we don't have to rush it, I think 10 minutes, just you know, let the veggies cook through a little bit, like just catch them a little bit. What's, uh, what's tomorrow I got, I wonder? That's the fagioli. Put behind you. Gosh, you never know with him. I mean, literally, he comes back with stuff in the middle of anywhere. He'll find, he'll find stuff. If you were in a war, he'd be great. He'd always be fed. Uh, I've brought you some chicoria. Ch chicoria, nice fresh rosemary. Look at this parsley. Incredible. Where have you borrowed this from, do you know? Uh, uh, well. That would be great. Well. What we do? So I'm just going to literally cut it badly. Davide, per favore fare una fotografia. Needed some spice. Quite generous on the black pepper, okay? After cooking a long time, like 30 years, generally, in your imagination, you can see and smell stuff about 80%. So it's pretty hard to get it wrong now. Unless it's a new ingredient or a totally new principle. Sometimes I cook things and they're really good and uh, we put it into testing and when the girls are replicating it by words it's not translating somehow and we we have to sort of like what have we done what and you, you've got to find out where it's almost like being a plumber and there's a leak somewhere but you just don't know kind of quite where it is the testing part which is what all the girls do is a is kind of the key really i think that's ultimately why people come back and buy another book because the recipes really work they've been really drilled come around Ginny. don't be scared don't swear at me Ginny often swears at me through her teeth she thinks if she does it through her teeth, it doesn't count. <laughs> so this is called Maltagliata, badly cut. Honestly, I can see a few bits of grass in there because Ginny's boiled it under a tree. Under right? an olive tree? Yeah, I can see a spider that's fallen in there. <laughs> a bit of extra protein. Guys, we're, we're one minute from plating up. So this is quite crude. And that's badly cut pasta. So one of the big mistakes that British people or non-Italian people make is draining the pasta in a colander and letting the life steam away. So what, what we are trying to encourage is the emulsification of fats, some of which come from the pork and then obviously all the olive oil and the water. As you boil them together, there's a moment where fat and water come together and you give silk, right? And it's a moment and that's why Italians are very specific about mangiare, 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 because if you just leave it on the plate, if you just leave it in the pan, stodge, half of this dish is texture. Now we start to try and find that moment. Some parmesan goes in, not too much. Right, can you, can you see how the sauce has almost gone silky now? Look, 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 look. get in there, close up, close up, close up. Um, that's a big hit of recipe because it's sausage, pumpkin, Pasta, parmesan, pepper. Big hair. Very happy with that. So I'm just doing long strokes of parmesan. Go and get some more bay for me, darling. Yeah. Um, so we've taken our rustic shot, we've done it in the pan. We've shot it like this, with and without parmesan. Just, uh, and then now, because we're quite proud of the use of bay, we're just being slightly five-year-old kids. Um, and this probably won't get used, but it might be really good for social media. Um, or it might get in the book. So that's, that's, that's that.